Hey everyone, it's Beth Ann from BrilliantBusinessMoms.com and I'm going to just show you real quick how to use hashtags.org and I think the main purpose of hashtags.org is if you are ready to create a brand new hashtag that centers around your business, your blog, or maybe you're having a Twitter party, you need to head to hashtags.org and see if anyone has used that hashtag before. So for example, I put in bizmom and um, It'll show you a, a sampling of the analytics and it's essentially no one is using that hashtag. Um, and then over here it would have a definition if someone had added a definition here. Um, so then that means there's a pretty good chance this is not a registered hashtag and then and there's no related hashtags here, related tweets, nothing. Um, and so that could be one that we could use or maybe biz mom chat. That would be super fun, I think, if we ever wanted to do a Twitter party. Um, but let me show you an example of like mompreneur, which is obviously that hashtag has been used quite a lot. So then we should see in here that yes, there are analytics for this hashtag because people are using it on a daily basis. So, um, and you can kind of track popularity too and see, you know, more people are using it at 9 p.m. Um, of course, after the kids are in bed, <laughs> that's when mompreneurs are working. Um, and then down here, it's kind of interesting because they'll have, now some of these are, you have to upgrade to view, which I, I don't want to do. I don't think that's quite worth it to us right now with our business. But um, you can see some of these smaller categories. Related hashtags would be handcrafted, kids, Gothamist getaways. So I'm not sure why that's related. That Someone must be doing promotion. Home biz. Okay. So Jamaica. Hmm. Interesting. And then social media. So you can see related hashtags that people are using that could give you other ideas of um, how to use hashtags in your tweets. And then what I really like here is pro mompreneur prolific user. So it's telling me these are the other profiles that love to use mompreneur um, when they're tweeting. So they might be people that I'm interested in following. I'm interested to see what they have to say. And then they show um, some recent tweets that have mompreneur in them. So again, I thought that was pretty cool. It can just, you know, give you some ideas of who you should follow, um, what people are talking about. Um, let me try one more and see if this gives me more insights too. So yeah, I mean, it's super easy. Okay, so work at home mom is actually, it seems like it's being used more often than mompreneur and its peak is 1 p.m. So people are tweeting about that more in the middle of the day. Um, and then let's see too. Hmm, this little parent. See that? I find that surprising. I would have thought they'd have more parenting stuff, but they're using work at home mom a lot. So interesting. And here's this Julie Holloway again. So I need to check her out and see what she's about. Then here's home business showing up again. Podcast is a big one showing up. Work at home. So, okay, cool. At any rate, that's how you use hashtags.org. You can create your own hashtag and register it there. And um, now it's your turn to get busy on Twitter and head... <laughs> Oh, get busy on Twitter and be brilliant. All right, see you guys later.